Hi guys, welcome back to my channel today. So today I'm gonna do the sec most most requested video, which is on pharmacology. So this is a wide topic, so I decided to do two parts of it. So today I'm gonna do the first part, and I will do the second part soon. So uh, I hope this video will be useful for everyone. So I so without a further ado, let's get into the video. So what is pharmacology? Pharmacology is derived as pharma and logy. So what is pharma means drugs or medicine and logy is study of so the whole thing is study of drugs or either medicine. So same thing. What's the general meaning is that study of aspects of drugs especially the mechanism and action of drugs study of effects of chemi chemical agent on living process. So you cannot advise a patient on the action of drugs uses and side effects without having a good knowledge on pharmacology. So general pattern of ph studying this pharmacology is as a common of pharmacology drug group. Introduction of this group is how you can introduce is mode of action. So if there is a drug, how do you, you introduce it is indication and side effects should be memorized according to the mechanism. So drugs act by modifying biochemical and psychological process that normally occurring occurs in the body. So classification of drugs in most cases according to the potency. Indications is where the disease which the drugs should be given for clinical use basically so memorize at least two to three indications of a drug and what are the side effects unwanted effects of drugs that occurs in normal therapeutic and predictable adverse effects is harmful or serious and unpleasant effect of drugs precautions is conditions where drugs must be better to avoid take care to minimize or avoid the side effects what is contraindications? Contraindications conditions where the drugs should not be given, maybe absolutely or relatively. So what are what is dosage form when single drug is available in different kind of preparations, such as tablets, capsules, injections and syrups. So as you all know, there are some drugs that are available in different dosage forms. If you take cetrizine, this is available in tablet and also syrup form. So dispensing instruction patient advices which given at the same time of dispensing. So if you are aware of any dosage forms, do let me know on the comments below of the drug name of the generic so it will be helpful to others as well. So I will give you all a practical point. Frosamide, as every one of you know, it is taken one daily, it should be taken nocte or morning. So it's specially taken in the evening times or morning is fine, but not at night. Uh, so GTN is oral or sublingual, you should know that. Antiemetics should should it be taken half an hour before meals or after meals. OCP one daily every day and also all suspensions should be shaken before use. So I just gave you all the practice points to understand how it is taken but these are not the answers. If you know how these are taken do not forget to comment below. Patient counselling. Patient counselling is an important professional responsibility of the pharmacist and defined as follows providing information to the patients or caregivers regardless disease medication diet and lifestyle modification modern pharmacology drug discover and design specialized field involving with design and synthesis of new drug molecules or modification of naturally occurring compounds drug delivery system design of dosage forms such as capsules tablets injections which deliver site of action clinical pharmacy use of drugs in the treatment of disease biotechnology the latest field that uses advanced biotechnology molecular biology is a tool to understand modern pharmacology uh, sorry for the inconvenience in the second point instead of injections it's mentioned as infections so sorry it's a error so uh, it's injections i hope you found this video useful 
If you found it useful, please do not forget to share with all your pharmacy friends and also please do not forget to subscribe because that's very very important. So I will see you guys in my next video.